you'll see as the sun goes down and the temperature gets a little lower and uh, the UV strength kind of goes away and it makes you go from a t-shirt mode to wanting to put on a, a hoodie or if you're from Saskatchewan, a bunny hug or if you're from, uh, well, I guess people in the States probably just call that a sweater, but as things cool off, the tortoises, they all adjust their own way. And this is one thing I'm really happy to see is each main adult tortoise in a clay pot. And even though we have another hide or tunnel, which I think other videos will touch on the tunnel topic, but uh, we have one tortoise, March. It's her first time probably outside. Uh, but that into once my ownership has been her first few times outside. And uh, you see, she's just buried right down there to barely a speck for shells there. And that's the importance of having a strong retaining wall. As you can see, I have it partially buried. So this torch would have to dig through the ground, then down and underneath about four inches, three, four inches under the cinder block, all the way under the cinder block, through the cinder block, and then out this turfed in grass. If they want to escape that badly, they may. Uh, the rest of the yard is pretty tortoise proof. As you can see, I have about a one inch gap there underneath the fence boards. That's actually sealed if you look really close. And that's pretty well the entire yard kind of thing. So as far as escape proof goes, but I'm not too concerned with these disappearing tortoises. I'm really looking forward to as these are the coldest nights that they're going to experience. And as things get warmer and the plus 40s come, well, I dress on more shades. But this is tortoises reacting to a cooler environment than indoors we'll say like it's still above 15 but uh it's not their basking spot of 31 and their cool end of 21 that they're totally used to so there's some adjustments going on and i'm just allowing them to do this as naturally as possible i'd like to add some heat to the shed as i stand up here add some heat to the shed and uh and make that more of their their overnight environment especially on those frosty nights sometimes we get snow in may you know that right people that may long weekend you wake up tenting in snow but as far as the disappearing tortoise goes it's always best in a safe and secure predator predator proof environment your pal hops and scotch over and out